meningiomas are the most common tumor of the brain, and they can occur anywhere along the surfaces of the brain. A subset of meningiomas arise in an area that's along the skull base that are accessible through this neuroendoscopic approach. These procedures are typically done with my ear, nose, and throat colleagues, and we will open up the space behind the back of the nose, and then we will open up a membrane which separates the brain from the skull called the dura, and the tumors will sit literally attached to them or right above them. And we dissect these out. Once that is done, we put in multiple layers of tissue, basically to put wallpaper over the defect to seal it up. And we'll typically also insert a small drain to divert the spinal fluid. It just takes the pressure off that wound as it's healing. And we'll typically leave that in for two to four days. And then the person is able to go home. The healing process is relatively simple. You don't bruise. Uh, there's no cosmetic disfiguration. Right after surgery, you look just the way you looked going into surgery. It tends to be relatively minimal pain and approximately two-week recovery process.